Welcome to the Passive Crypto Show. I'm your host, Income Pal. Just an average person sharing my experiences on how to earn multiple streams of passive crypto income online. So feel free to watch for educational purposes and learn from my mistakes as well as benefit from my experiences. And only follow along at your own risk if you decide to do so. Also, feel free to read the full disclaimer in the description below. And if you're new to this show, most definitely subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell to stay up to date with the latest ways to earn passive crypto income online. And as always, all relevant links to whatever I share in my videos can be found in the video description below as well as in the pinned comment. Also, make sure to subscribe to the Telegram channel t.me slash passive crypto show or alternatively search directly on telegram passive crypto show to always be up to date with the latest content and information with that being said let's get into today's video today's video is a follow-up to my initial video which i did about the uni token the unisop protocol token okay and i mentioned a bit about it now in today's video i'm going to show you guys the easiest and most simplest way that i have found to be able to earn uni tokens okay so previous video we talked about claiming buying etc and i did uh, refer to how you can earn the tokens as well by participating in liquidity pools okay uh, in this video i'm going to show you how you can do that but in a simpler and easier way instead of having to go around the uniswap route or route okay anyway so let's start this video so the way to participate and earn uni tokens by joining the liquidity pools is using zappa.fi now i have shown you guys how to use this in the past on some other protocols okay but i'm gonna use it and show you how to basically earn uni using zappa.fi all right so obviously once you get to the website i'll leave the link for it in the video description or pinned comment you click uh, connect wallet all right once you click connect wallet you uh, choose whichever one that is you're using a lot of us or most of us would probably be using metamask so whichever one you're using select that to connect all right um obviously authorize your wallet so whether that be metamask or whatever it is so for myself that's metamask i want to you know um connect to zappa.fi using my account all right so now that it's connected it's basically signed me in to the platform using my wallet so what you need to do is you need to start off in the dashboard you need to go to the invest section so you can click the invest tab at the top next to the dashboard or the invest button here where it says put your money to work either way it will take you to the same section all right and once you get here you need to participate in the liquidity pool which would enable you to earn uni okay so in the previous video i talked to you guys about the four pools okay ethereum and wbtc ethereum usdt ethereum usdc and Dai uh, ethereum okay so these are the four pools that initially uni will be allowing the earning of uni with basically by participating in these four pools later on they you know may add other pools depending on the community votes all right so for now to start earning you need to be a liquidity provider in one of these four pools now the pool that you choose is up to you okay you guys can see three of them are you know ethereum and a stable coin whereas one of them is ethereum and wrapped btc okay so one thing to bear in mind is when participating in liquidity pools your you know balances can fluctuate one way or another so one token can increase the other one will decrease or vice versa right for example if you're in the wbtc meaning wrapped btc and ethereum pair sometimes you might notice your ethereum balance going up and your wrapped btc balance going down sometimes you'll notice the opposite your wrapped btc going up and your ethereum going down okay either way your balances will fluctuate one way or another okay over time and what you would in that case be better off choosing the pool which you like both coins or both tokens so in my case regardless of whether my wrap btc goes up or my ethereum goes up i'm happy to hold both and i don't mind one or the other going up 
versus the other one all right so i would be choosing this pool to participate in now if you're someone that prefers to you know uh, be involved with stable coins such as dai usdc usdt then you can choose one of those right and you guys can see on the right hand side it says add liquidity that's the button that you would press now zappa.fi is a brilliant interface it's got many other liquidity pools that you guys can you know participate in you can actually search by using the explore opportunity section here by typing in in the filter section which one is that you're looking for all right but you guys can see i'm already in the wrap btc uh, and you know ethereum one okay so wrapped ethereum it shows here and i've already basically added liquidity and i'm already basically staking meaning i'm able to earn um uni all right so if you guys were to go through the traditional method or the you know the one that was mentioned in the article what you would need to do is manually go into uniswap pools add the liquidity there and then from there go to the basically um, interface where you would need to put in your liquidity pool tokens to be able to start earning uni whereas here you can do everything on one interface within one interface without having to worry about also by the way owning both tokens because if you, when participating in liquidity pools you need to have 50 50 split of both tokens so if you're someone who wants to participate in one of these pools and you only have ethereum then you'd need to sell some of your ethereum to an equivalent amount of the other token so that you can then you know deposit both tokens in the liquidity pool but with zappa.fi all you need is ethereum and they automatically split it for you okay your ethereum 50 50 so you click add liquidity basically uh, you select the amount that you want to put in okay so let's say you want to put in two ethereum worth right and what that would do basically is that would split your ethereum 50 50 so two ethereum would give me a, the approximate pool output of one ethereum and 0 0.0332 btc worth okay right btc so that's the split all right so what you would do then is you would select the amount okay once you've done that scroll down you'd click confirm all right once you've con confirmed it and gone through all the confirmations all right make sure to obviously um accept the transactions on your wallet whether it be metamask or whichever one once you've done that okay now you've basically got liquidity in the uh, li uh, liquidity pool all right now that you've done that you can come up to your investment section all right and it shows current investments and where you can see on mine it says unstake because i've already clicked the stake button that's why you can see my status is staked what you would need to do is click stake and obviously upon clicking stake confirm the transaction and once you've confirmed your transaction then you will start earning uni okay so that is the easiest and simplest way of getting involved in the liquidity pool and starting uni okay feel free to refer to my previous article uh, video where i referenced the four pools which i mentioned in this video as well that you can participate in all right and i've shown you guys how you can easily participate using this platform um let's see how much i've started earning uni so far I started recently so already almost earned half a uni in rewards now this uh, interface can be used to claim your uni rewards uh, whenever you want obviously it'd be a good idea to let them accumulate to a certain amount before claiming because you got also you know take into consideration the gas fees that is required to be basically able to participate and get involved in these kind of ventures okay uh, getting involved with a small amount would not really be so beneficial because you'd be spending a lot on gas anyway so me personally i've gone you know in with around a thousand dollars worth of the values have gone up so my pool currently is worth around you know uh, 1400 but obviously the dollar value will obviously always fluctuate so you guys can see my um, wbtc at the moment is 0 0.07 and my wrapped ethereum is 2.03 okay so why did was i put in four ethereum to start with that was split into um two wrapped eth and um can't remember the exact wrapped btc but around that much okay and values have been fluctuating as obviously the benefit of being a liquidity provider is you earn the transaction fees that is always happening okay and this is one of the 
pools which produces a good amount of volume so definitely a good one to be involved in as well and as i've mentioned my preference for getting involved in rat ptc and the ethereum pair over you know the other ones which are ethereum and the stable coins is because i prefer to earn crypto using this method okay i'm not really interested in increasing my stable coin uh, balances and that is what can and uh, you know end up happening if those are the you know pools that you're participating in but if you're a person that doesn't mind holding one of the other or you know is happy with having the stable coin balance increase as the ethereum balance decreases or you know it could be the other way around depending on how trading is done then obviously you can choose other pairs this is my pair of choice and i've mentioned my reasoning and the way to look at it is basically the way liquidity pools work is when for example i'll give you the example with this pool that i'm talking about right right btc and ethereum so if more people or basically more ethereum is being bought and more right btc is being sold then what's going to happen is obviously the pool is being used and you have a share in that pool so think of it as your pool for now okay for example so from your pool people are buying ethereum and selling btc that would mean your btc or up btc let's say balance is going up and your ethereum balance is going down and then obviously once the dynamic switches obviously trading is always back and forth there'll be times where people are buying uh, more at btc there'll be time where people are buying more wrapped ethereum so really whichever one they're buying the opposite one they are selling okay it's it, uh, it makes sense all right i'm not gonna try and uh, overly break it down but that's basically the basic logical understanding and breakdown that i can give you guys all right so i'm just trying to reiterate this point because i have received like questions in the past regarding which pool to participate in and why Okay, and that's basically what I'm trying to break down to you guys here. So hopefully you guys find this video beneficial, informative, and hopefully enjoyable. So please make sure to like this video. Also, if you have any questions, any feedback, you know, any comments, whatever the case, all right, obviously leave it in the comment section below. If you haven't had a second up until now to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell, please make sure to do so and obviously make sure you're also subscribed to the telegram channel which i showed you guys t.me slash passive crypto show or alternatively you know search directly on telegram passive crypto show now this is the dashboard of this platform zappa.fi okay uh, you can switch the view by clicking this tab that says switch view and it will basically give you a breakdown in this way of what you own and you know whatever you have in that particular wallet so this is what i have in this particular wallet all right um you can leave it on the default view and you could basically click each section to check what you have all right so it depends on you know how you like to use it so you can even see on the dashboard you can come to the yield farming section and you'll be able to see your you know claimable unit there without having to worry about going into the investment section and check on what you have all right so anyway guys i'm going to leave it here for this video until next time i wish you all massive passive crypto income and gains in your passive crypto portfolios until next time thank you for watching and goodbye